Hi, uh, I'm Steve Gadd. I'm here in Italy on the uh, Mission from Gadd tour. Zildjian was the first symbol that I ever saw. Um, I mean, I started playing when I was three years old, and uh, and when I was seven, uh, I got my first uh, little bass drum with a symbol on top of it, and it was a Zildjian symbol. And um, and then my uh, my first complete drum set was uh, had had uh, Zildjian cymbals. So I've only ever played Zildjian. And then when I started playing professionally, um, I was offered uh, an endorsement with Zildjian. So um, I've been with, with uh, I've played those cymbals and been uh, with, with that company my whole life. And uh, it's, it's, it's a great relationship. Tonight I'll be playing a 20-inch uh, Constantinople, a 20-inch orchestra ride, uh, an 18-inch K dark thin crash, uh, there'll be a 15-inch A rivet cymbal, and um, a 14-inch uh, K hi-hats. Uh, the, the top one is the original one I bought in the 60s. And the bottom is a is an A uh, with rivets in it. So, without further ado, please welcome the one and the only and the legendary Steve Gadd. So I'm, I'm here to spend the evening with you guys. Um, I want to, you know, I'd like to hear, you know, your questions uh, about uh, technique, about uh, headphones, monitors, time, and uh, I can share with you uh, my experience and try to demonstrate or answer any questions.
I found some prototype symbols in Armin Zildjian's office, some ride symbols that I loved, and I played those for years. And the K prototypes were, you know, we tried to copy those symbols. And um, we tried to copy the crash that I was playing. And when I was uh, in the Army in, uh, in the late 60s, I went to Brooklyn, New York to the Gretsch Drum Factory and bought K Zildjian hi-hats and uh, and I still use I still use one of those hi-hats today the heavy one and um, so the K customs were were a copy of that symbol the size and the and the weight so they they were just you know they were duplicates of uh, trying to replace the symbols that I was already playing <laughs> Ciao Italy, thank you for everything.